El Paso professional wrestler Cassandra Exantico is having life story, uh, his life story is dramatized in the first narrative film based on his larger than life persona. A very well known Mexican actor with uh, will play Cassandro in the Amazon film. ABC 7's Iris Lopez tells us more about the movie and the story behind Cassandro El Exotico. I could just cross the border, go to a Lucha Libre. That was my free therapy session for the weekend. In the ring, he's known as Cassandro El Exotico. But out of the ring, he's Saul Armendariz, a fronterizo Chicano. I grew up between fronteras, you know, uh, Ciudad Juarez and El Paso, and the, one of the biggest sports here was uh, Lucha Libre. Saul has graced the ring as Cassandro El Exotico for over 32 years. But being a professional wrestler wasn't always his passion. I ended up in the gym by, by an error. My friend told me, like, hey, come on, come train with us. I was like, no, hombre, estás loca. I'm not going to do lucha libre. That accidental visit to the gym helped Saul transform into the person he is today. Well, I found myself in lucha libre. I first discovered who I was not, and then I discovered who I was then. And now the rest of the world will be able to watch Saul's journey as Mexican actor Gael Garcia Bernal portrays Cassandro El Exotico in a new film for Amazon. A month ago, I, I received a call from Roger Ross Williams, the director. He's like, guess what? We got green light from Amazon. I was like, yes, finally, no? And it's from a fronterizo Chicano little boy, fatherless. You know, he, he struggled a lot in life being border cities. Uh, with an identity as well, uh, issues since I was seven years old. For Saul, this film is about more than his struggles as a child. It's about encouraging other young kids to never let obstacles get in their way of reaching for their dreams. The intentions of the film and the purpose is to send that message, you know, they, regardless how many times you fall down, you get up and then believe in yourself, find your identity, embrace it and fly and give it away. And Iris Lopez, ABC7. It's an important message and uh, I have to admit, I have some hair envy just watching that. <laughs> Filming is set to begin January of next year in Mexico City. I wish I had it, Stephanie. Oh, I think a lot of us do. <laughs>